I want to thank everyone for coming to the Spooktacular, the 2015 Spooktacular. These are the two folks that have uh, put this whole thing together. Steve Josephson from the Toy Box and Roberta, his right-hand gal, who bought all the costumes, put this um, haunted house all together for us, and did a wonderful, wonderful job. Steve is going to tell us all about what he's been doing for the past couple of years with the Spooktacular and the Chamber of Commerce. Every year we seem to be growing bigger and bigger. We originally started out on the old firehouse on Mamaronac Avenue, uh, and uh, last year we had to move out of uh, the firehouse on Mamaronac Avenue, and we kind of like corroborated with uh, the Mamaronac Recreation Department and the Mamaronac Chamber of Commerce, and we're all working together down here at the harbor, and we're growing every year. This year we made one haunted house. Uh, instead of two haunted houses, we're gonna keep the lights on for the first hour and a half, and then after 2.30, lights will go out and it'll be spooky, scary, and Lots all is gonna cave in. Um, here's Roberta, and she'd like to make a comment or two. Thank you very much. We welcome everybody to come to our haunted house. We enjoy having you, and wish you all a happy Halloween. Rain or shine uh, every year, and, and it's just a really nice community experience. Um, my daughter loves to paint the windows, and it's just a really nice atmosphere. Um, she likes to dress up for the parade, there's a parade, so it's, it's just a lot of fun. I think last year we did the cupcake store, ABC Cupcakes, and that was a really nice store to paint because of all the cupcakes and the colors kids were going in and out for hot chocolate and dressing up so I think that was a really nice store to paint and had a nice atmosphere. Okay, painting. Pumpkin head. Pumpkin head? And what does that say? Beautiful. Beautiful? Very cute. Look at the camera sir. Do you like dinosaurs? What's your favorite kind of dinosaur do you have?
Say hi, guys. Oh, wow. Well, this is the Village of Maranek Arts Council table, and it's the first time we're in the spectacular.
showing you multiple horrors that are within this house. Over here, the coffin that holds the dead, which is pretty interesting. Watch out for the lonely life horrors that live and lurk in this place. The ghosts here are full of horrors, so watch out, watch your step, watch your head, because you just might lose it. This ghost has been hanging here, waiting for a soul to eat and to capture. Now, the witches, goblins, and carcasses laying all around. Spiders crawling all over the place. So if you're afraid of spiders, this place is not for you. Ghosts all over the place. Now, watch as the cute little little skeletons play the banjo pretty interesting watch out for all the monsters and look in the darkness ghosts pumpkins that are alive witches and skeletons now there are multiple different people, oh. goblins, horrors, that look. Oh. They're just the lost souls that live here. So, if you are afraid of zombies that give tour guides, this is not a place for you, because I'm a zombie that gives tour guides. Now, there are multiple different scary people that are awaiting you to scare. There are walking pumpkins. Get ready to scream. Get ready for the spirits that are here to await your screams. Flying vampires that are ready to suck the life out of you. And heads that are misplaced from our guests that didn't make it. Now at the end of our haunted house we have a cupcake station. Feel free to get some cupcakes, because they're good. Frankenstein is due for a new hairdo. I'm thinking of removing this scalp for a new hairdo. I mean, I'm already dead, so <laughs> it's a new fashion. We do a lot of crafts with the kids. We do cupcakes, cupcakes giveaways. And they have a great time. They have a haunted hayride. They have the haunted house. Just an all in all good day. The parade started with two fire trucks and the chief's truck. And then I followed them. And then there was a young lady, Karen, from the uh, village um, Recreation department who was throwing candy to all the kids and we had a parade of a, a couple of hundred children So even though it started off as not so great a day, it turned out to be a beautiful day. The sun came out and Blessed our spooktacular with some good weather and we're having a great time right now with all these children out here Steve's working on next year's already so I'll let Steve to I'll let Steve explain how much work and effort goes into these uh, productions 
every year it seems to be growing and uh, I'm happy about that and uh, you know it's a lot of preparation and thank I'd like to thank uh, Frank from the House of Flowers because he's the one that does all the drapery and gets us all started uh, for the haunted house and then Roberta and I start doing all the decorations and the hanging and uh, we get everything prepared um, we have a new sound guy this year that did a ph phenomenal job we have lights that are new this year we have the smoke machines that are all updated and we're going to be a real scary uh, two and a half hours we also have performances by different groups that are housed in Mamaroneck um, rock bands and different performances for the children and we hope everybody comes out and has just a really great day. And we'd just like to thank the whole village of Maranek should thank these two folks for what they do. They devote a tremendous amount of time. Steve spends the whole year. He From tomorrow he's going to start telling me about next week and next year's show. So he's really involved in this. He's involved in the community. He's involved with his store, but he's also involved with the Chamber of Commerce. And we've got to thank both these folks for all the time and effort they put in. So thank you from the Village of Maranek and LMC TV. As a member of the Board of Directors of LMC TV, I want to thank the Chamber of Commerce for sacrificing the firehouse. And hopefully that firehouse will become the new home of LMC TV. So let's go LMC TV for the firehouse. Beware!